Hey everybody, Jem Schofield here with the C47 and another episode of Gearbox. Fingers crossed I get this one off because I've got a little guy who just woke up who I'm trying to bribe with a movie and everybody's out. It's wedding anniversary day so I only have basically this take, otherwise trouble. Okay, so just got back from Cape Cod and in a few days I'm going to be getting my Canon PowerShot S95. Size-wise, probably a little bit bigger than this little Lumix that I've had for a number of years. But um, I'm starting to think about this. And what I'd like to do is come up with a backup little mobile um, still photography and also video little system. Now, this is the little uh, flash bracket here from Alzo, which has two cold shoes on it. So I can use that to mount something like a, a Rode video mic and then maybe with a little adapter something like this H2 and I could record directly into that um, but I'm actually gonna look at the new Zoom H1 and see how that works because what I'd love to be able to do is just have a little stereo mic on top of here recording double system and then have the S95 on the bracket and I think that's all I'd like to have on there. Maybe, you know, I'm kind of toying with this idea. Hold on. So it'd be sort of more like this with just the recorder there. And then toying with the idea, depending on the, um, the way something can mount, of maybe putting something like a, a Z Finder on there. But I think that might just be too much. The other thing I'd like to do is look at options where I just use a little lavalier mic. This is the Rode one and have that go into something like an H4n but that's a little bit big and unfortunately these smaller units don't have phantom power so I'm looking into stuff I've got a bunch of stuff bookmarked and I think within the next week or so I'll have come up with something so this is my my S95 um, adventure I also have um, bookmarked a little adapter kit that you can get the um, there are 37 millimeter filters and what I'd like to be able to use are ND filters and also a polarizer with the little camera so I'm looking at some stuff like that so I know it sounds crazy but that's what Gearbox is all about so I'll report back soon and I'll see you guys next time on Gearbox